Hello ladies and gentlemen, yes, Zeke here again today to bring you another episode of Let's Play Monster Hunter Double Cross. So you might notice there's something a bit odd about me right now, and it is that I am wearing absolutely ridiculous armor. Um, I got... Uh, this is the earliest set you can get that has both Guard Up, which allows me to block moves that were previously unblockable, and Artillery, ma artillery Master which massively increases the damage that I do with artillery. So I now have that, and um, I also have unlocked a new area in the game because I decided I didn't want to repeat all the stuff I had already shown you guys. So what I have is I have an air balloon! Air balloon. I've not been to it yet, and I have not done any of the mission, and this is the very beginning of high rank. So I am pretty damned excited. Look at that, look at that cooking spot, and the guild marm, or whatever they call her in this game. So much more game to play! So much more mouths to feed, and ain't nothing in this world for free. I said I can't hold back, I can't slow down, oh you know I wish I could. Well there ain't no airships for the wicked, until we close our eyes for good. This is probably all very important stuff that I'm going to have to figure out at a later date, but... Whoa! It's like a little city in the sky. I love it. It's a forge. What do you got to say to me? Do you have new items? It doesn't seem that way so far, although it does say that my pickaxe is new, even though I have a couple hundred of them. A couple of hundred of them. I also picked up a mite seed and an adamant seed. If I fight some Devil Joes in the future, it'll be, those will be upgraded to the, or they're pills right now, they're not pills. They'll be upgraded to charms, I don't actually remember the exact name of the things, I just know how to get them. So, I will be doing that shortly. Nope, oh, Guild Marm losing all our papers. You're too high up in the air, you need like a notepad or something. What do you gotta say to me? You just talking about cats? I assume he's just talking about cats. Seems likely that, that that place isn't a place. Isn't that like... Okay, I don't know what he's talking about at all. I'm gonna have to figure that out later. Is this my home? Oh, my little airship cabin! Why am I so excited about this? I'm just happier than I should be. Might as well sort my stuff and um, pick the right item set. And then go to my inventory and sort it. And then... And then you know what, I'm going to be setting that as my main thing. Okay, let's figure out what we're gonna do. Hunt a little hunt. Do a little dance, get down tonight, talk to the chef, and specifically sit down and eat. Attack up and third from the bottom. Because it gives me feline artillery. I forget what it's called. But it gives me the one that increases my artillery damage. Okay, I understand. You probably have a lot of things to tell me, but I can't understand any of it. You know, for a game with so little story, or at least the story is secondary, especially in this one, it's what the... Oh, no, it's the farty monkey. I don't even remember what this thing is called, but I hate it. So, where do I go to leave? Just, like, jump off the ship? I'm sure they showed me a clip of where I leave. It's not at the front. It's my stash box. So you'd assume it'd be somewhere around my stash box, right? Is it the front? Yeah, yeah, look at that. I got it. I got it. I got it so bad, it's driving me mad, it's driving me mad. Oh, and a new location. 
I'm so happy, happy, happy as can be. Very, um, Incan, if I do say so myself. Terrorists, you know, they're playing the pan flute at you. All of the usual. So, since I'm in high rank, I only get a map to start. But since I am lazy, I also get Psycho Serums. Psycho Serum, something crazy. ba 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 da ba ba da Go, 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 fight the farty monkey. Okay. Time to actually get down to business. I kind of wish I remembered what this thing's called. It shouldn't be very much of a problem. I guess I maybe should have brought some meat unless I really want to be using Mega Dash juices here. High rank damage, if I remember properly, is always at least a bit of a surprise. No, you're not leaving, are you? No, you're not leaving. There we go. Nice big hit right off the bat. And there is his fart. Oh, yeah, he odorizes you. There we go. Get him dead pretty fast. I don't think he can shake me off now. Yeah, I was too far ahead there. go. Stays down for a fair amount of time. That's nice. At least enough to get me my third blast off. I'm gonna go all the way up to four before I, um, before I grab the wyvern fire. Also, I don't entirely know when to go about wyvern firing. Probably right now. No, there we go. I assumed he wouldn't go back and forth more than, like, two or three times there. Maybe a stupid assumption, but... It worked out, so that did not hit me, and now I'm odorized. So four whenever he does that. Haven't fought this thing since um, four ultimates, so I'm not as familiar with it as I once used to be. Again, still slightly unsure about how to slightly unsure about how to... I don't know what I'm talking about. Nope, I completely lost it. Maybe he's more of a sloth, because he has those long finger things. That's very sloth-like, right? Ow. Okay, that one actually hurt. So this is upgraded as I can get at present. I need to get out of the way. Yeah, there we go. Oh, he fell over. No, he didn't fall over. He just looked like he had fallen over because he... Ow! Okay. Time for me to get out and wait for my... Oh, wait. He's doing a thing. He's eating. I got healed at the same time, though, so it doesn't matter too much. There we go. Fortunately, I was in time enough to see that I had my wyvern fire. Sometimes I just don't even notice that it's off cooldown. There we go. Completely missed me with that. And his mushroom is gone. Ow. Really thought I had that jump in time. I have another dragon blast, so might as well use that right away while he's down. This guy seems to get knocked around a lot. Not that I'm complaining, it seems perfectly like a good thing for me, but... Also, it might be partially because I'm playing a large burst damage weapon, so you tend to get... Oh, he's eating something else? Stop eating! Oh, he's got more gas! I saw that gas coming out of your ass! There we go. Quick little unload. This reminds me of, um bit of a Dragon Ball spoiler here, if you guys are concerned about, like, hundred-year-old spoilers. I do not know where he went. Um, but, reminds me of the fight with Krillin versus, like, the Stink Man in Dragon Ball during the first tournament. Like, three, three quarters of the way through the fight, he's losing, and Goku's like, Krillin, you can't lose to this guy! 
You don't have a nose! And Krillin's like, oh wait a second, I don't. It was, it was a good scene. I liked it. I liked it a lot. There we go. Been jumping up a wall because I did use my Mega Dash juice. If I was going to use it, I should have used it earlier, but... Ooh, back to another Wyvern fire, huh? Oh, he got me! I really thought I would have moved out of the way of that, and it didn't reodorize me, though. That was, like, specifically paralysis. I was going to say I'm going to wait for another mount to do my Wyvern fire. I thought it was going to be coming up pretty soon. Oh yes, and if you're trying to remember now if Krillin does or does not have a nose, he definitely does not have a nose. And apparently it is actually like legit that's part of the plot, he doesn't have a nose. There we go. Killed the hell out of that with the back end of my wyvern fire. And I have another dragon blast charged. Uh, this makes me nervous, what, what are you doing? That didn't seem too bad. What was that? Two hits out of four! Because he fell over! I did it too well! What I really have to watch out for now is catch requests because they won't tip me off by giving me a trap anymore. See, that might have been one of those unblockable attacks normally. Whew! Got right out of there. It's a good thing too, because I need to use a potion pretty badly. You looking for something to eat? He is indeed more mushrooms. I know I have low sharpness right now, but I feel like I need to get the damage done while I have the chance. Oh man, Murdoch is right in front of my screen. I'm using the computer screen right now, so. There we go. Fortunately, I had time to jump right down the cliff there. Should probably be paintballing this guy. Oh man, what? Does Odor now cause me damage? Does he have like Ultra Odor? Might as well start by sharpening. Odor doesn't prevent that. Okay, Murdoch, get out of directly in front of the screen. Get out. Okay. Now I just wait. Good enough. Let's go. Can't help but notice I have another um, uh, wyvern fire ready, so I'm going to be doing that as soon as I am able. Hey. Oh, what? No, like, wind up to that at all? Oh, well, at least I'm stuck at my high damage. There we go. One and two and block his punches. I actually did hit with those, which is nice. Now, it's also important to note that high rank monsters do damage through shields. Not much though, and maybe even less with guard up, but I think that's actually less with guard plus. Ooh, good timing. Get wrecked! So he jumped to the right. Fortunately, he doesn't really cast a shadow or anything that I can um, follow, but hopefully he's in area... Two? I guess I'll check two, then I'll check eight. Seem like the most likely options. Ah, there he is. Since you're just roaring, I might as well reload. Right, get over here. Let's make this a fair fight. Man versus fart monkey. Tail as old as time. I think. Oh, okay, I thought I was actually just out of range of that fire breath. Did they just give this guy more breath weapons, or did he always eat different mushrooms to get different effects? And I just completely missed that aspect of the fight. 
Oh, come on, I panic dived. That is what I call halitosis. A disease made up by the Listerine Corporation. And yes, that is actually true. Not a real thing. Now, there are probably diseases that can cause bad breath, but there isn't a disease that is just, like, bad breath, the disease. It's because they weren't very, they weren't very successful um, as the company they wanted to be, which was a cleaning product, they decided to sell their product as mouthwash instead. There we go. Dead and gone. Now, should I make a, myself a fart lance monkey? Fart lance monkey gun lance. Fart monkey gun lance? <laughs> Not that the real thing was too much less ridiculous. Ridiculiculous. Ridiculigula. Killigula. Killigulicula. I don't know what I'm talking about. I should probably look for something to mine or harvest. Ah! I've wasted all my time. I'm in high rank now, I'm gonna need new minerals. Give me them sweet, sweet minerals. There we go. Perfect. Managed to completely mine out one node. There was another node like right behind me. That seems like it might have been actually the more efficient one to go to. In retrospect, yep, I'm still running around. Mission not over. Um, uh, game. Whoa! Warning. The hell? Oh, is, are they gonna introduce the blast dragon? Blast dragon! Check it and see. I got a blast dragon. It's a hundred and three. Come on, dragon! Blast off to the sky. Blast Dragon, Blast Dragon. Okay, it's telling me like a whole set of new objectives, or am I fighting this? Quest clear? Oh, no, it's just showing me it. Okay. Fair enough. I would take him the chance to fight it. I'm probably not ready, but I'd do it anyways. No victory music, this is so disappointing. Don't like that at all. That victory music's important. Do. Re mi fa so la ti do. Sorry, I figured I'd piss people off if I didn't sing the actual notes. Do re mi fa so la ti do. But uh, it's been a long time since I've done that for any reason at all. Yeah, I know. Blast Dragon's fucking crazy. Do I get Wyvern Fire level 2? Oh man, I, that's a bunch of stuff. Anti-air! That anti-air one um, is a Gunlance ability that takes things out of the sky that is new. But anyways, that's where I'm going to call the episode because I am going to go figure some things out. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.